In the last video, you saw how you can install the latest Python version, that is Python 3.14. In this video, I'll show you how you can install pip, that is a module that you can use to install Python libraries. So first, let's check our Python version. You can just type Python, double dash version, and you'll see your Python version. If you see something called Python command not found, check the link in the description below. You will see how you can fix that. And now let's see how you can install pip. So go to get pip. I'll have the link in the description below so you don't have to search anything. I'll just have this link. You can just click on this link and you'll be taken to this browser. And now scroll down here, you will see this script. Just right click on the script and click on save link as and you can save it wherever you want. I'll just save it in downloads, no problem. Once this is saved, just browse to that directory. And now you need to open terminal or command prompt in this directory. So the shortcut to do that is just go wherever you have downloaded this, click on the address bar and type CMD, hit enter, and you'll have command prompt open inside this directory. And now it's very easy to install this. So just type Python and then get you can just hit tab to autocomplete. Okay, so you, this will come up, come up, get pip.py, hit enter, and your pip installation has started. Let's wait for a few seconds and the installation will complete. And then I'll show you how you can use it to install modules. Okay, so now pip is successfully installed and you can just install any module or library by typing this command, pip install, and then your library name, let's say numpy hit enter and numpy installation will start and you can use this library in your python scripts now so this is how you can install pip and if you have any errors like pip not found or something just check the link in the description below i'll have the links on how to solve that